In terms of design, the appearance of the new Audi Q7 has changed significantly, adopting the new Civi design language. The front face is equipped with a new mesh structure and a new two-dimensional flat-style Audi 4-ring logo, which looks more stylish than the current horizontal and vertical style grille. Second, the new Audi Q7 comes with four new body colors, Sakir Gold, Istanbul Red, Ascari Blue and Waitomo Blue. In addition, the outline and internal structure of the headlight group have been adjusted, and the angular segment aerotype LED daytime running lights have been set on the light group. The standard matrix LED headlights can realize independent control of each light-emitting unit. High-end models can be equipped with a combination of high-resolution matrix LED plus laser headlights. The high-resolution matrix LED headlights have higher resolution and can provide more precise lighting control for the vehicle based on matrix LED headlights. As high beams, laser headlights have a maximum illumination distance of up to 600 meters, almost twice as long as matrix LED headlights. The traditional decorative panel in the fog lamp area has been adjusted, the grille elements have been made richer, and L-shaped elements have been added near the edges on both sides to highlight the sporty atmosphere. The lines on the side of the car are smooth and orderly, giving people the feeling of a straight suit. In addition to the chrome trim on the edges of the windows and the bottom of the doors, the double waistlines have been retained, and a new B-pillar laser engraving process has been added. In terms of body size, the length, width and height of the new Audi Q7 are 5067-1970-1731mm, respectively, and the wheelbase length is 2,999mm. This new Audi Q7 offers 21-inch wheels, two 21-inch Audi Sport wheels and 22-inch wheels. Among them, the top model, 55 TFSI, comes with 22-inch Audi Sport wheels as standard. The remaining models are equipped with one of three 21-inch wheels according to the configuration, and all wheels except for the high-end models can be freely selected. The tail has a full shape, and the center chrome-plated strip connects the OLED taillights on both sides. It has slightly adjusted the invisible exhaust pipe on the lower fender to maintain its sporty feel. In addition, the top model of the 55 TFSI comes with electric intake doors as standard. It is worth mentioning that the new Audi Q7 is the first model currently on sale in China to combine high-resolution matrix LED headlights with Audi laser headlights, signature digital daytime running lights and digital OLED taillights. The interior maintains the Audi family design style with upper and lower screens. Even today, when color TVs dominate, the technological atmosphere is not bad. In addition, the car has a full piano-type paint panel, which shows an elegant style. The new Audi Q7 series comes standard with an extended leather equipment package for the interior. The upper part of the dashboard is made of Nappa leather, while the door armrests and center console trim are made of artificial leather. The top of the range model is also equipped with a high-end extended leather equipment package to further expand the coverage of leather in the interior. The two central control screens in the car are both touch-sensitive and basically cover most of the setting functions in the car. The upper screen has a built-in MMI system, supports Apple CarPlay and other mobile phone connections, and also has an LTE function, which can realize 4G cloud traffic data sharing, Wi-Fi hotspot, remote control, and other functions. The new Audi Q7 continues the 2.0T and 3.0T power combination. The 45 TFSI is equipped with the fourth-generation EA888 2.0 TFSI engine with a maximum power of 195 kilowatts and a maximum torque of 370 nrm. It adopts technologies such as Miller Cycle Combustion System, Variable Valve Timing, Two-Stage Variable Valve Lift AVS, Dual Injection System consisting of in-cylinder direct injection plus manifold injection, and thin-walled cast cylinder block. The 55 TFSI is equipped with the EA839 3.0 TFSI V6 turbocharged engine jointly developed with Porsche, which produces a maximum power of 250 kilowatts and a maximum torque of 500 nrm. The matching 48V mild hybrid system is permanently connected to the internal combustion engine via a belt-type alternator starter motor, BSG, connected to the crankshaft, which effectively improves the comfort of the start-stop system, reduces turbo lag, and improves acceleration performance. The transmission part uses the same 8-speed Tiptronic transmission as the Porsche Cayenne. The new Audi Q7 offers seven driving modes, including off-road, energy-saving, comfort, automatic, dynamic, personalized, 
and all road conditions.